With COVID cases rising, we wondered if Minnesota political leaders would still go to the fair. The answer is yes. Morning anchors Jason DeRussia and Heather Brown interviewed U.S. Senator Amy Klobuchar and U.S. Senator Tina Smith when the gates opened at 6 this morning. Then they tried one of the fair's new foods with Lieutenant Governor Peggy Flanagan. <laughs> like most Minnesotans, you can tell that Lieutenant Governor Peggy Flanagan missed the state fair. How do you feel being out here this year? To be really honest, when I first walked into the gate, I was like, is this real life? Is this actually happening? Because I think so many of us have just been waiting for the opportunity to come together. And we absolutely have to be cautious and thoughtful. She's wearing a mask as we talk to Charlie Torgerson, the pit master and owner of RC's Barbecue and the mastermind behind his newest food, the Naughty Biscuit. Questions, are you ready? Yeah, of course, we can take as many. I mean, there's been a little anxiety, I think, about what's the right thing to do, what's the right example to set. And I have a, you know, I have an eight-year-old kiddo at home. She's unvaccinated, and so this year, um, we're not going to take her to the fair. And that's hard, but it's also what's right for our family. And, and I think that there's other folks who are struggling with that decision, and yeah. um, that's what's best for us. We're going to have to be able to, to manage COVID, um, but also know that there's opportunities for us to to move forward, and and uh, I'm eager to do that too. The lieutenant governor's top three fair good. things: crop art, <laughs> the education building, and a surprise. Of course, ye old mill. Yeah. It's dark. It's weird. <laughs> I love it. Game. Right? Love it, <laughs> totally. <laughs> Heather and Jason talked with Lieutenant Governor Flanagan about COVID and back to school expectations too. And we will share that part of their conversation tomorrow morning on WCCO.